Hi, and welcome to this year Vlogtober. Today is day 3. I'm taking the opportunity of this sped up clip of me taking measure and preparing paper to do a check-in. The little character you've witnessed taking life on paper is Apolline. Some of you may remember her from my sketchbook session in the cafe in my last vlog. I picture her as a wise, comforting character, yet a tad clumsy. Anyway, as a quick explanation for those who may not know about it, October is a month where I love to challenge myself by producing an ink drawing every day for the whole month. It's a well-known month for illustration challenges such as Inktober, Peachtober, Drawloween, and so forth and so on. There is a wide array of prompt lists and techniques to pick from. I've been doing this challenge for the past... Wait a minute. It's already been 9 years. Some years were harder than others. I even failed to reach the 31 drawing mark in 2021. Or oh, maybe that was 2022? I'm not sure anymore. But health and work and family and life and sometimes other things force us to review our goals. October the 4th today and I thought I would make a tiny bit of a, an update. So this is the situation so far. I have my three first illustration done and I decided to add a new person into this little little universe that's appearing here. So, so, so she appeared so she will be today's illustration and it will be for the word backpack. This year again I want to do ink sober, but since I've been quite uh, overwhelmed by work and other things lately, I decided to be a tiny bit soft. I'm going to try to have 20 illustrations done, and this is... why is it so dark? This is the material I'm going to be using. They're from several different years of Inktober, and so I'm going for something that makes me feel happy. So I'm going for full cozy vibe. I have not installed my usual uh, crazy contraption on the side so I can film overhead. I don't know if I will, but it is true that 
seeing the process from a top is better. Thanks if you're on this video and I hope you enjoy the rest of it. And since it may be a bit plain or lame to just see process after process, I will try to add in a tiny bit of full vibe into this video, like cozy content. So yeah, welcome and let's get to it. Take it just in case What are you waiting for? Mistake you to me Good morning I just see this one The day after And I really like it I really like the vibe So that's good That's real good There is a teeny tiny pumpkin over there. I guess these are teeny tiny butternuts, but I'm not sure. Maybe they're zucchini, but then they look a bit sick. These are very orderly fennels. I don't like fennel, but some of my family member loves it, so I cook it sometimes. And I do find it very pretty, especially the wild ones. I don't see any around here, but I will show you if I see some. Brussels sprouts, they're so cute and tiny. And over there, I think it's kale and red cabbage. 
and get some kind of salads and many leeks oh maybe i should say that this is a a community garden close by that i like to go to because it's very pretty at each season there is a lot of flowers and veggies and bees and it's even though it's close to a road it's very peaceful here it's a tiny butternut it's not that tiny but it's still a butternut this one is a bit bigger all the one I, I saw before were like so tiny like this and this is bigger it's them this is wild fennel it's very pretty these kind of look like Christmas ornaments I like them As I ever mentioned how much I like these The leaves, the fruit the flower when it's spring, everything about it. Hello. I guess the blue sky is gone. Time to head home. It's daytime. My cousin got me a carrot cake. Thank you. Hey, we can see each other. Hello. Hello. Wait, uh, how do I? I don't know. Well, you, you can see the camera, okay? You can. There is a tea party I'm going there. Look at it, they're dancing. You may not. So, we have a beer with like a red and beer. It's like a beer, so 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 it's like a beer, I have also a Unipin brush. I have the same in like two variation of grey so I can make some some adjustments for what I want to pop on the top and what I want to kind of fade a tiny bit. So these are the inking things. Uh, lately I've been using these, this mostly, to do my sketches. I sketch into this sketchbook which is a uh, there's still the good old same Sakura sketchbooks. Uh, so yeah, I've been sketching my IDs in here very roughly and inking some of them very roughly. I'm going on a travel at the end of October, so I may want to paint a couple ahead of time. Even though, as I say, this year I decided to get all chill and well, so I only decided to go for 20 illustration. I obviously secretly hope to do 31, but, but you know, work and travel and life and health. So let's, let's not overburden ourselves. Today's Sunday, so I have a lot of time. I finished uh, editing the video that went out today and you probably have seen it if you're following this channel. Then I had some time to sketch in my sketchbook 
and I did this little illustration. I'm really happy with this one. I kind of like this too as well. So that was uh, that was the update. God, that's such a long update. Hopefully I will cut into that and it's not six minute long. The silly Inktober setup is finally there. With old unused sound thingies. How do you call that? I don't know. These old enceintes, which are not used anymore. And I use as a contraption with pieces of wood that I have left over from when I built my desk. And then paper, so I can like set my phone on top of it, just on the edge, and so I can film from the top. This this is this is what what you see when I film from the top. It's here. My silly setup is here. Happy October. Some morning I'm just really tired and luckily for me that one was on a day off so I just snuggled up in bed and worked on my last video thumbnail. The video seems to have left a big impression on you all and I'm very grateful for the lovely comment and new people who join. Honestly I'm also a bit nervous. My channel is a tiny one and that video just doubled my audience in one go. Anyway welcome to the new entities who join in. I hope this place can be a tiny blanket over your soul when you need. Hopefully see you in part two. Cheers!